Welcome everybody to the carding. I am here with Rai. This is going to be Alice Van Cleef versus Ace R. Yes. And we have Oregon on the pick fans. AFC Ben Carrier. Um, Ace Ben Overgrown. AFC Pick Sand. Temple is picked by Ace. Okay, AFC Ban Cash. That means we have Melon Alley Atom. Okay. Melon Atom. And now we're going to look at Bot Channel. And it is going to be Melon because I, um, I said Charlie could do the. Okay. Promo. Me, please. Alright, so we have Sand, Temple, oh, uh, Melon. And so this is going to be fairly interesting. Uh, Rai, your thoughts? Just PM me them or like something. What? Like. Okay. Um, my thing is lagging. I can't click it. But. Exposed. That's how noted. Got a hack. Uh, P promote jam on walls. Yeah, now I think it's gonna go to one to ace, but I think the pick fans favor ace. Click. Yeah, my thing. Alright. Oh. Right, promote me back. I'm stupid. I forgot you could do that. I forgot. Yeah, sign temperament. Alright, right. Okay. Okay, let's do this. Uh, sand. Okay, there. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Alright, so now this game should be happening. All of AFC have the same skin, it's so mad. ASP. Uh, right, you can do slash message app a developer kit, and it's the same thing as doing slash chat p, except for that pm. Oh, hot soldier. Not yeah. Azu Azu has has my vote for winner of MVP of the tournament for this. Okay, um, let's do this. All right. So, some people. A shop. Yeah, AFC are strong at sand. I think Ace are also pretty strong. It's A for AFC. I went TB by accident, I chose to be spectator, you know. Yeah. Ha ha ha. Skill. Skill arena. Alright. Alright, me. Let's screw up. Alright. Autism is my superpower. Yep, that's a pretty strong superpower. You gotta make the jump, it's super easy. You just guys gotta have skill. Alright, we have the proper teams this time. Alright, so Alice Fan Club are going to be on the CT side, Ace on the T side, and Sand is AFC's pick. Um, like you said, AFC on the CT. Um, but I feel like Ace are also fairly strong in this, although Pigs is by far their best player, and like Pigs is quite good on this map. So it's going to be two cross for AFC, one spot mid. Um, Lone and Miso both spot this out. I think Lone's AFK. Oh no, 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 no. It looks like it's going to be a B split right now. MG is spotting mid, but the tunnel's push is happening right now. Um, that is Char taking down Lego. Azu will trade with Ice, and Char in car right now gets taken out by Azu. Azu getting two entries on the site. Um, now Scott and MMG from mid. Miso is flanking. Miso did take down Attacker on a Lurk, but Scott did take down Azu in the door shot. Alright, but now there are two players lurking, Lone and Miso. Miso takes down MG after trading with Lone, and... Ala takes out Mimo, this is actually very doable for AFC. Zaluk on the side, Zaluk takes out one, and Miso gets the perfect flank! That was a perfect flank for Miso. Zaluk did a great job of staying alive there on two health. And, yeah. Yeah, so, 
Right, your analysis. Yeah, like, I think just nice entries from Azu, then great, great lurk kills from Miso, as well as the loop did amazing job saying life is life, but it's a B rush. And it's a full on B rush. Miso, Bimo gets an entry, and it's an ace I take already. So Luke gets another, and it's an A stack, but it doesn't matter. So Luke gets two, alone gets another, and ice on cat is gonna be, be peaking. This is not a smart idea. Alone gets two. Uh, MMG and one on six with a pistol. They AFC did a nice job of full saving. They did not force by. Um, as Ace's one of Ace's strongest rounds are their anti ecos. They do great anti eco. Uh, the problem he, by the way, you really but yeah, no, the problem with Ace, Ace's one of Ace's strengths is their anti eco. So Alice Ryan Pump did a nice job saving. Bimo with two, Lone with two, Zaluk with two. Very clean. And yep, Ace now are going to be winning two to zero. Um, and this is the quarterfinal. Whoever loses is out, whoever wins faces the winner of OG and SCP. So, yeah. It looks like this is gonna be the full buy, buy round now. Um, Miso and Bone both took 30 or so damage from mid, from two mid players, but Vimo rushes out a long, gets a pick on ice. Ace have a long control, it's gonna be an ace split. I can sense the ace split. Four coming, Cat, Lego gets an entry on attacker, and Hala is left on the site. It's gonna get entry by Lego as well. And there's one player, Lego with a triple. Yeah, MMG got picked down quite a lot. They did get taken down by Lego. Lego could get a five pair here, but Scott will take down Azu. Um, yeah, Miso trades, but Chara trades back to uh, Chara in a one on four. Gets taken down by Zaluk. Nice shot there from Zaluk. So Ace are just playing so clean on sand. Like, they aren't playing with pickies. They don't have a strat caller, and they, like, I sense that Azu's calling for them, because Azu also knows how to, how to strat call. And, like, yeah, he's. So, as you knows how to strike call, so I sense he's strike calling for them. And, but Piggies is not here, and so they don't have their top breaker and their strike caller, but as you just rushes out mid doors. I, th I think they're going mid beat. Attacker will take down Lego at Cat, but actually two kills right now. Attacker could get two right here. Bemo, Char gets two at B site. It's three on four now. Yeah, that was a super aggressive. I feel like they got over aggressive. Bemo's now super low. And they're down a man as well as Bimo's incredibly low. Attacker takes Bimo down with a body shot. Attacker being dropped to 12 HP. Yeah, they got punished for it. And Lone working out B site does take down Achara, but Lone very low health. 19 HP and a 1 on 3. We've seen them do this before, but on a higher health. But Ice, yeah, no, they're gonna be B site. Ice takes Lone down as soon as Lone reloads. Nice job. There. That's 1 3 for Ace. And they just got too aggressive there. As he ran out, May got an, an opening pick, but he should have just fallen back from there. He didn't have his team with him, and with that attacker, Cat took down Lego, Char, and then they tried to just go two and to be a Char to take them both down. And we're seeing the taunts, like the taunts out from Ace. And it's a full long control. They do have full long control. There's a player car. Yeah, maybe. But uh, Ice is stuck car. He's gonna get that nade barely missed. That nade, yeah, would have killed him if Bimo did not take him down there. But Bimo takes down ice. There's two players crossing CT. Chara and Attacker both get one. Chara gets two. Chara could get a third right now. Chara is gonna get a third on Bimo. Nope, Bimo takes down Attacker on the flank. But Chara, Bimo is stuck between a rock and a hard place between MMG and Chara, who gets another. Lone in a one on four now. Where's Lone? You know? Out long. Okay. And. Yeah, so that round just char. They need to kill Chara there. They didn't kill them. They need to either cross or kill Chara, and they didn't do that. So it's three two for Ace now. And yeah, it's going to be two players. Azu is the both get lit twenty one HP from the mid player. Um, Azu with a nade out long. They have that same long smoke, meaning they could take control of it. But Zaluk will take down attacker, but all the base are low basically. And Bebo gets, and Zaluk both get one. I'm not sure where Bebo is, but he just got a mid pick. Uh, Zaluk gets a third entry. Zaluk is on fire right now. Like, 8 to 2, Lego going 3 to 3, but filling his role. Azu's doing a pretty good job strat calling, in, considering he's 3 and 4. Like, he didn't job fragging, considering he's strat calling. He's, and like, Bebo gets fragged in mid by Scott, but. Lone takes 
down some, takes down Charya towards long, and Miso takes down Scott in mid. So, it is now 4 2 to ace. Alright. So, right now it is 4 2 to ace. AFC on the T side. What do you think ace, AFC need to do on the T side just to bring this back? Because they are going to go for the classic mid rush, and they always rush mid. But here's where. Like Ace have to have predicted this. They do a AFC do this every single round. As he's already rotating cat, this is perfect. They have the two players cat. They know exactly that it's a cat push. They just know AFC too well. Lone Lone trades with Charo, but yeah, all of AFC could get trapped right now. Lone takes Azu takes down one. Lone takes it down another, and they are holding it. Azu with that beautiful rotation early as soon as he spots the mid. Lone does get fragged, and there will be Lego taking down MMG on the flank and. Azu could knife, could knife attacker right here, and he does. Ice will nade Lego, but Azu is a god. So now, Chara gets uh, dropped down to 15 HP. Um, Azu gets a pick. Um, yeah, and now you're just seeing the clean anti ecos from Ace that they never lose. Ace are just too strong at it. It's Bimo gonna get one more frag Lego to get a triple. And I sense like it's match point for Ace. They're about to go ma one up on Sand. I feel like. So yeah. Azu with that incredible play on the pistol though, that still cuts him out. Azu's gonna be picking him in. He gets dropped down quite a bit, but he does do a lot of- he drops ice and um, aloe really low. He will get picked by Chara, but he got the info, and now he has full ghost. Kind of a bad Molotov from Chara. Yeah. Yeah, okay, gotcha. Lone is gonna take down Scott, and the bomb has dropped a cat. Lone has 23 HP. They should just fall back here, stay alive, while they're waiting for Lego to rotate. Lego is going to rotate as we Lone get, takes down one more. Lego takes down another. It's now a 2v1 for Zaluk. Zaluk in 2v1 on 68 HP. The bomb is dropped, and he has the bomb. But yeah, no, Ala is going to hit the shot. Um, and yeah. Okay. Uh, so yeah, it is going to be 6-3 to three for AFC, they did win that gun round, and now it looks like it's going to be an eco for Mace. Yeah, it's make or break, they have to be flawless from here, and while Sand is one of their best maps, looks like a cat step. Yeah, it's 3, actually 4, considering they were winning 6 2, but Miso gets 2 out long, I think. Yeah, that was out long. Miso gets 2. That's insane, that's already a man up for Ace, although he was, yeah, he was traded. And Bimo and Lone are on the Ace, I think. Ace have, they have, Azu's also rotated, Azu's playing a really good rotate right now, he has, and it looks like AFC are gonna get trapped in long if they don't do anything instantly right now, and Bimo Monk 2, it's over, this map's over, it's already one up to Ace, Bimo gets another, and Bimo gets a third! Bimo 6 confirms, <laughs> nice. And yeah, I'm getting stats by the way. Uh, just, uh, okay. And next map is Temple. It is Ace's map pick. Like, they won on AFC's map pick, although I sense it's going. I sense, though, that it will, won't be a totally one sided just because. Yep. Did Piggies get on? Right, when you're uh, up again, just message me. Okay. Okay, so it is one up for Ace, and I feel like L is Fangled. They just 
they're getting just totally destroyed by Ace right now. Ace are on their CT sides had a really good rotation and Azu like he was playing that perfectly. And then on the T side they just AFC weren't hitting their shots on the CT. The one person who was was Chara who was just absolutely carrying. But yeah. So one up to Ace. It's going to be AFC up against the ropes. They have they have Temple and Melon. Both teams, both maps, Ace are comfortable on, and I don't think AFC are comfortable on Melon. And they on Temple, I feel like they're okay on it. But yeah, I don't think they really just the third map. They need to win the second map for sure, and it is Ace's pick. And then they're uh, fighting an uphill battle on map three. So. Right is relogging. Every they're spamming me to join because Piggy's just joined in. They're like, we don't need Piggy's. Um, Ace are spamming to hurry up. Go as fast as I can. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, no. They're spamming so hard right now. Yeah. Pigs wants an invite. the second you have the pack. going to be temple and yeah <laughs> no sense for piggies he's not kidding all right so it looks like it's going to be afc on the t side and ace on the ct side ct is definitely the more favorable side although i think this is one of those maps where you might want to actually get T side first, just so you know how much, how many, how well you'd have to do on the CT. But AFC are gonna go on the T side. Now, there's really only two things they can, two or three things they can do here. They can rush B, they can rush bridge, or they can rush under. If you don't rush, you're dead, and it's going to be a B rush. And yeah, they have two B. That makes sense. Uh, Lone Jake get dinged down quite a bit, but they need to actually get the crossfire set up. Scott gets dropped down quite low, but BMO already takes down MMG. I think, yeah, BMO actually is totally on the flank, and this, this is a really nice play for BMO. He now forces them to worry about four angles right now, and it's getting totally retaken. Um, Alo does take down the flank on BMO, but Azu almost hits an awesome aim. Yeah. Yeah, they are all low though. All of AFC are low. I feel like this, this 3v5 is very doable if, like, all the wall bangs. It feels like you're throwing marshmallows at people and then trying to kill them. But literally every player in AFC, the highest is 78 HP. And that's. Yeah. I agree. And the bomb's just gonna explode. There's not enough time for haste. If they can get kills, pad the stats a little bit, that would be best. And attacker's gonna die of the bomb. Let's see if Ice pushes. He really should not push this. And. Yeah, no. So that was a really nice T side pistol. And yeah, that was just a really nice T side pistol. Um, really, all that happened was Ace just didn't go fast enough. Like, AFC did the classic B rush, and they pulled it off well. They got the plant immediately, and nice smoke, but that smoke will give it away, although it's already obvious enough. Um, now, let's see how 
ace retake this, because they are eco. They should not be anything except eco. Um, they do have a shotgun on me, so Alvart is probably the best shotgun player in the game. Um, MMG will take Frag Bimo, who is trying to flank, I believe. Yeah, MMG fragment from under, and... Yeah, it's Deagle's on a shotty. They're just trying to retake this. And it's not gonna happen, obviously. But let's see if they push through, because Miso actually gets dropped quite a bit from the wall banks. And this is actually where wall banks, they still do enough damage, because you can just, so many people can't buy the doors. They can just kind of kill them by death, by paper cuts. Like, really, that's what it is. And I think MG got too aggressive, almost got taken down by Miso, but now it's a Luke. One on six. Yeah. Attacker dies to the bomb again. Um, attacker, you're not you're not doing a good job for the tournament's KD. <laughs> and that bomb explodes, you know. And we're seeing the L's from Ace and MG instantly leaves. But it's going to be two up to AFC, and now this is where we see how strong they can be on their CT side. Now, it's a B rush again. This is where Ace, Ace really actually have to counter this, because they have to stop the rush. Lego is gonna get walling to death, but it's gonna be keep getting twice gay, I'm getting three, and Miso gets another. So, Tacker gets killed by Zulik and mid, it's an MMG and a one on five. Um, yeah, no, they're not winning that. It's no, Miso gets two. Then that's will be the round. So, Ace are, when the first gun rounded, I feel like they need a 4 2 now. They, they already are down on the Temple CT. And okay. yeah. So, they're down for it. They need a 4 2, and then they need to actually do really good on the T side, maybe force an overtime. Okay. Got you. Azu is actually gonna get two kills. Lone, or Az Lone and Azu are both gonna get two kills. Uh, Bimo gets one more in mid, Azu gets another, and yeah, it's, there's just no chance. The ice in a one on five. And this is really just attrition, like, it's just waiting out who's gonna, and as he's gonna push it, let's see if he checks his corners, he does, he does, and as he gets a triple that round, as he's playing actually quite well for, like, uh, considering I'm almost 100% assuming he's IGLing, but like, he's the only person on Ace who can really IGL, so, considering he IGL for IVP in TI3, and, yeah. That's just my basic assumption. And so now, Lego and Lone, Miso snipes Ala. And yeah, Attacker will take down Azu, who tried to rush, but Miso gets another snipe kill. Uh, if he gets three, that, that'd be the best. Like, Ace are one of the best sniper teams in the game. And you don't see them pull it out often, but when you do, it's actually very strong. Beemo gets two. And Ice in a one on four. If he clutches this, it's, it's a game for. AFC like because they just either CT side could be too strong and it really should not be pushed by Ace. They don't need to push him. He has to push them. He has no time. Like he just okay, it's gonna be an A for me, so let's see if Ice actually checks us. They're gonna be triple beaking them. This could go horribly wrong. But no it won't. Lego takes him down. And my nerves are saved. That could have could have gone just so horribly wrong pushing. They did pick Temple, so. Yeah. Map 3 would be Melon, and I really just don't think AFC would have, really have all that great of a chance on it. Just because it's, a, just because Ace are so good at Melon. Like, they've actually got this a ton. Miso gets two sniper kills. Um, this trade immediately by Attacker, so now it's a 4-on-4 four four in this, the, oh, they actually have retake the side. Okay, why did Azu buy a sniper? He gets one, gets traded immediately, he snipes ice. And now, the sniper is, okay, no. If our ace gonna get too cocky and lose the round, Bimo will take down MMG, and Bimo takes down the chart, which is good. But now attacker's getting double push, Lager takes him down, that almost, that almost got scary. Um, ace with more sniper kills, because of course they do. And now Ace are on the T site. Yeah, so. Almost pulled out, and that's actually scary to think about. So, yeah, now it's 4 2. And the question is 
if ace actually like can bait up AFC, if AFC overextend on the, like for example, if they just think, oh, it's for sure gonna be Bish, and they, they do the mid smoke, but they're rushing out bridge actually. This is actually a beautiful setup. And yeah, no, there are three players bridge though for AFC. They actually kind of predicted this loan. That Nate could do some damage. No, it's not going to. Um, yeah, it's already, the pistol is gonna go to AFC. I think the pistol is going to go to AFC. Oh, AFC perfectly, actually perfectly predicted it. It was so smart, but at the same time, I think it just, the smoke kind of, that smoke is like, I think they just shouldn't have really thrown it. Because, um, because you can just, even on the bearish you can see, and I think AFC stuck mid. Because I think they were expecting something else. A like Ace never really up like the rush. Ice is gonna get two on the eco. And there's just nothing that they can be done. And Ali gets one as Ice gets another. And yeah, it's over. This map is going to definitely go to AFC. I can almost 100% guarantee it. Plus Ace just totally utterly come back. But yeah, no, Ice is, could get a 5k right now. So, yeah, so Miso is just camping with a shotgun. Yep, and now AFC are doing the smart thing. They are not pushing. Miso is camping in the corner with a shotgun. Yeah, yep, that, that's not a fun thing to happen. And yeah, it's just going to be full on the control for Ace. They are just pre-firing spamming it. <laughs> and let's see if they actually check their corners if they push through. But no, they're just waiting them out. Don't give them exits. Miso is pr the probably best shotgun player in the game. And he's gonna rush out. Ice takes him down. Ice with a 5k. So now it's 4-4. Four, four, first gun round. Must win for Ace. Absolute must win. Like, if they lose this, they're gonna be forced to eco. Okay. And then if they lose it, it's just not gonna happen. It's just not, it's not really a thing. And yeah, it's, they are actually rushing me, they're doing a good job. It's gonna be, the bombs a loop went only with the bomb, and now AFC have full on the bomb. And, let's see if they get over aggressive. There needs to be picks. Is out at bridge. Um, I will take down Bimo, interestingly. Um, but yeah, the bombs look went so with the bomb. I don't, I don't see Ace winning this, this map. Yeah. Yeah, no, they have a bridge. Yeah, no, they they dropped the bomb on. B like, no, dude, they dropped. They is a loot rush and he had just threw smoke and they did the whole thing. Also. Yeah, no, it's, everyone's going to get taken down, and everyone's lagging out. Yeah, and so, <laughs> who's doing it? Who's doing it? Awesome. Yeah. And, yeah, it's Lego is solo in 1v6. Let's see if he can get something. Like, that's all I'm interested in. Because so if he can get exits, he can get some money, but nah, it's not happening. Okay, so now we need to see if Ace can actually full on do this. And yeah, so yes, it just has to happen. Something has to happen for Ace. They need to do something. As like, and there's not the great great buys. Miso's already dropped very low. Scott pushes that could be very dangerous. But you know, attackers gonna take down the eco wing as who just had a pistol. Lone does take down Scott towards his bridge, but yeah. Let's see if they work towards bridge. But I see a rotate coming. It's gonna be an underbridge split. This could actually work so well. And Bimo, yeah, Bimo and attacker. Bimo gets taken by. I cannot block actually. Luke is 
just look in Lego though. Are in mid, they could do something, but yeah, it's a two on three. Two on three Lego. So, oh no, MMG takes out Luke in mid, it's over. It's over, and it's 6-4 to AFC. Now, the losing bonus is in favor of race. They're actually learning, earning quite a lot of money. But yeah, no. And yeah. So, yeah, Ace, I just, yeah, I don't see them actually having a chance. Be watching, they rush me though, they look at the entry. This is very doable, and so they just need to keep on like what it's too. Are we gonna get to see Ace get totally hero played out of this? From that double kill from Lego. And all the play, it has him and Bimo get the play kills. Uh, Scott in a one on four. And he's gonna get pushed by Bimo, Bimo takes him down. Are we gonna see Ace get hero played out of this? And now, yeah, yeah. So now it's five six. This looks like it's gonna go to overtime, and I might eat my words. But AFC should have some money. I'm not sure about how high it is. Like, if you look at entry by MG, they stop to be this time. Luke does get one, but it's straight immediately. Lego though gets another. It's a 4-4 four four already. But, yeah. All of the kills. Lone gets another. Miso gets another. It looks like it's going to overtime. Face actually clutches this out. Miso gets... Scott pushes out B doors. That was really dumb. He should not have done that. And Ala gets taken down by Lone. It's overtime. It's overtime. I'm start... Yeah, I gotta start chewing. It's... Oh my goodness, Ace. And now it's a gun round on CT. Okay, whoever wins the first T side round here, whoever, okay, wh whoever's the first to win a T side round in overtime is gonna win. I can guarantee it. I uh, know, it's going to be a B rush. Of course it is, from AFC. But let's see if they can get the kills. Scott gets two. It's Scott gets the four kills. It's Azu and it's Luke. Yeah, I take some down. Oh, did they get the full beerish? And now, AFC winning seven to six. And now, this is actually getting so intense. Mid smokes, big double smoke mid. Okay, there's nothing you can see in there. It's just if AFC are smart, they'll just shoot into it. MMG is gonna take down Lone, and that smoke might have actually harmed them. Azu gets one, but yeah, Char with the two. Lego could, gets one, but yeah, Lego gets, needs to get more than this. He's gonna get killed. Yeah, no. Lego on very low HP is nothing you can do. It's a one on four for me, so. And it's GG. Bought a sniper. Why did Miso buy a sniper? Yeah, get stats. Got you. And yeah, Miso's gonna get naded. Nope. Almost drops him to 30 HP, but he's getting mollied. Okay. And it's going to be 1 1. Okay, so, 1-1 one, one for AFC, it, and Ace just had no attacker left the party. Who's coming in, is the question. Okay, gotcha. I almost like I'm dragging in. We are going to go to map 3, 
This is do or die for both teams now. And yeah. JFN beat Power Beast. Yeah, JFN beat Power Beast, and we are going to go to map three. And yeah. Alright, so. Okay. So yeah, Chafin beat Parbeast. Parbeasts are out now, and I'm fighting about this. Yeah, what was the score? And so yeah, it's going to be Melon. This is a better map for Ace. So oh my goodness, Odin! I just saw the stats. Odin carried for Chafin. Odin hard carried for JFN. Top ranked both games. He went uh, 23 to 7. Alright, so now on the CT side, AFC on the CT side, and yeah. Yeah, I did. Okay. It's going to be. Okay, so now whoever does lose this map is out, and it's all down to the map everybody just hates. Which is Melon Factory, and it's a B rush from Ace, and nobody spots them. They they did the hardest part of doing the B rush, which is not having mid players spot them. They will get that name drop. Drop Scott actually quite a lot of HP. Scott's gonna get taken out by Lone and Pigs and Lake. Yeah, it's all the kills. Ace are, already got the two opening picks, and it's the rotates are just gonna come in. There's just not enough time on the rotations. Bonker and MMG are coming from B long. And they are actually very fast by Melon standards. But it's already 15 seconds on the bomb, and yeah, Lone is going to be taking a fight with Chara. Chara takes down that Lone that equalizes the situation, and no, Al is actually going to retake this. It's a two on three. AFC are going to retake this if if Ace don't stay alive. And Piggy's one on three. The bomb is not going to be defused right now, but it's going to be Pigs in a one on three. Takes down Chara, and it's nine seconds. Pigs just has to buy like three more seconds of time. And no time. There's just no time. Both players died of the bomb. Pigs. They did not pull him out in. Yeah. And so Pigs did take down Char there, and I believe Char did have the only kit. Um. And now Piggies. Yeah, it's Ace are gonna win the pistol on the T side. Now Melon is a very T side map. And yeah, BMO will actually need Ala. And yeah, all the entries BMO gets another. Azu gets knifed on somewhere, not sure where. Uh, that is nice money for MMG. And they, that means they will have an M4. Although they get taken down instantly. Yeah, and so Luke gets one, BMO gets three. BMO is actually very good at those anti ecos, is what you find a lot actually. Is that just for Ace in general, BMO is just quite strong at the anti ecos. And now it's. Five rounds till Ace are going to move on, but AFC just have to do something to stay alive. It's true, they have to win this gun round basically. The CT side's very hard, but I don't see them like they have to win one or two gun rounds on the CT side, otherwise, they're just not gonna win it. I'm like, okay, so MG rushes mid, takes a lot of damage. Scott will take down Azu, who went solo B. Um, actually, no, people went with Azu, but yeah. It's just, yeah, so Luke takes down MMG at mid, so now, so Luke is going to wrap this in, so Luke takes down Scott, and now BMO should perfectly, BMO's going to time this up, takes down Ice, and the bombs planted at B, the rotations have to come through for Ala, Chara, and Bonker, 
And yeah, pigs chase down Bonker on the lurk. Pigs with that lurk play again. Yeah. And now him. Now, shot. looks like Ala is going to take down pigs. Lego instantly trades. Nice trade there. And now it's one on four. And yeah, it's one on four. Char one. And Chara is gonna be saving. Yep. Has an Uzi, but yeah, they're gonna be saving armor, probably, which is the more important part, because that's really what harms you if you don't have the money. And Lego, two players are hunting. And yeah, Lego's gonna take them down. Lego with two kills. Nice job there. It's actually only going 2-2-2, two, 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 but Melon is definitely a very strong map for a. It's three up, and. 3 0 now. And yeah, Ace are getting ever closer to go moving on in the semifinals. And yeah, Ace I think are just showing to be the team that, in the end of the day, just played better in this game. Like I don't think a lot of what they've been sh showing, at least in so far, has just been kind of like they've just been hitting their shots super well. Everyone stepped up alone and actually playing well. And when Lone's playing well, you don't have much like. It's going to be Bonker. He's going to get rushed at this point because Luke gets the entry. So Luke actually getting really nice entries as he takes down Aula. And yeah, it's only Chara who is behind Lone. Lone could flick right now, but yeah, no, Chara's going to take him down. It's a four on three. Chara needs to do something, but Lego's going to take him down. It's two on four. Ice and Scott. Now they've been playing well at all this game. And it's a, Ice is going to take down Azu. And it's a three on two now. I just, they don't really have time. They're both in the choke point, one choke point that they're gonna get mollied off. This ice could burn, actually. Ice is gonna get dropped to 32 HP. It's one on three for him and gets taken down by Zaluk after Pigs takes down Scott. And it looks like it's GG. It looks like it's going to be GG. T side and map in action, although. Yeah. He just underestimates though how well Ace have been playing today, like very much so. And now where Ace are all gonna be going B, they will smoke it, but that could give it away. But they haven't actually made like haven't actually been spotted. But that smoke actually will give it away, and they're gonna just run out of the side. They smoke off the site. Bimo takes down Ice, and Scott gets trapped by P Piggies, and yep. So four on six, and now the rotations are coming in. So much time has already been used. And yeah, so Chara and Bonker are gonna be coming along. Azu takes down Chara at long hand. Azu's starting to step up now. And now two players are going to be coming along. Azu's gonna push it. Really should not push it. All three players. Oh, Beam was behind them all. And Beam was not gonna get anything. He needs to get something there. And now it's a four on three. But Chara, they're gonna be retaking the site. And they're all three are coming from B long. And but pigs and Lego, Lego and Melon, and how all the kills come out for Ace. It's five zero on T side Melon. And I just don't think Mel map three Melon. If like Atomic was picked, maybe, but like, I just don't think Ace had a chance on this map, or like AFC had a chance on this map. No, Ace winning five up. AFC, if they, they need something right now, Chara is the only person fragging well. And they can't do it alone. And so, yeah, it looks like Lone is actually going to be rushing up mid. Takes a lot of damage from MMG. MMG is actually going to take them down, although Lone did quite a bit of damage. Pigs is trying to snipe mid, but nothing is going to be happening there. And, yeah, it looks like AFC actually do have the map positionings now to win around. But, is it too little too late? Or can Ace bring it back? Those are the two questions that you have to ask. And yeah, no, Azu and Zulu get kills at mid. And now, Bonkers trapped in mid, he's taking him down by Lego. 5-3. And yeah, it's going to be 5-3. 5v3. Char is trapped on a long. And they know that they know she's there. Azu does pick up full damage. Okay, and yeah, it's a 4v1. Pigs get sniped. And Ice in a 1 on 4. Has not been playing well, going 1 to 5. And Pigs is gonna take him down. I'm not sure where that was, but. 30 seconds left. 
<laughs> okay, all right. Yeah, so it's six up, four ace, and AFC almost won that round, but then they just choked out, and now oh, ace just have to win this pistol round, and it's gonna be over. So it's all right. It's a, and now eight six so far. We've seen 21 rounds played in this in this game, or not, not 21 rounds. Yeah, no, 24 rounds played in this game. But this could be an easy 7-0, and yeah, it's going to be as it gets taken out by Char. Char gets an entry. Lone is actually going to get could get mated, but nah, they're going to get taken out by Al. Lego on three HP gets an entry, and it's just and yeah, bomb is going to be planted. It's a three five. The question is, how much can they do? Piggies is is going to come up the ramp. It's still on full HP, actually, interestingly. But Bonker Boy is going to bunny a lot. Like, a lot of bunny. And it's looking a one on five. Should just say if they had armor. He's going to get chased by AFC. And it's the round's over. And. Yeah, it's a really T-sided map, but I see Ace doing something on the CT side because they have practiced this a ton. I've actually, they've asked me to cast a bunch of it. I've casted actually most of it, and they practiced their CT melon a ton. So I think at that point it was just AFC kind of just IB plowed, like even though most of IB plow is on Ace, um, they just kind of IB plowed Ace at A lot, A right there. And yeah. Actually, so it is an eco for us. They are just gonna be going. Um, Bimo does have a shock. Bimo gets two at mid. No, this 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 isn't happening. This is it's a four and four, and Pigs takes down Scott. It's a three on four, and all the players are coming from mid. Lone have Lone have a shotgun. Luke does not have a gun, but he's gonna just run out. Get Holdy taken down. But Bimo and Pigs both have gun, both on full HP also. So it's a three on three. Ice is actually going to be playing an off angle. Lone, though, Chara takes them both down. Chara playing in exceptional role. Yeah, Chara is just hard carrying for AFC. It's getting kind of insane right now. And, yeah, it's just getting the hard carry. The hard carry, and now that w that was a crap ton of money for me. So now, as well as Pigs will get some money because, um, yeah, P will have his M4 on the snake. It's B, it's B rush. Okay, so Scott actually knifes Bimo towards mid because it's a full split. And I don't think they realize it's split. So Luke doesn't realize this. Pigs is trapped on the site. He's gonna get pushed. Doesn't. Nothing happens. Scott gets another entry, and it's a three v six. And yeah, Lego does have a gun. He's gonna be playing for mid. Um, the question is whether they can get killed. As Lego will take down Ice. Um, though Char will knife Azu. Uh, or knife Lone. Um, uh, Char with the incredible shot. And now it's a 1v5. Lego is going to be just saving nothing they can do on 9 HP. Um, let's see if AFC hunt. Like, because this map is very hard to hunt on. But. Rai wants the COT, but if we could see Ace just choke. And yeah, actually Chara takes home Lego. That's not even gonna be able to save. And Yeah, no. The question is whether they can get something here. Is it going to be a buy? I'm interested to see. Um, no, they all have their knives out. They're not stupid. They're running with their knives out. Yeah, but Bimo will get the buy. And so now it looks like it's a mid beast like kind of take. If if Ace if Ace can hold mid, that would be very helpful because that means they both have players that can survive on the site as well as they won't as well as they don't have players like a pig takes on Bonker Boy on the cross shot and they will maul him out. Nice job, nice use of the balls. This is looking to be able to both get kills. And two players are going to be coming for mid, but people gets another. And Scott, Lego, just do. And it will 
be 34 rounds played in the series, go into three maps, but Ace takes it. Ace will take the match. So thank you all for watching this recording. This will be up on the Competitive CC YouTube. Be sure to subscribe, and thanks for joining me. And right, bye.